Welcome back. If the chilly weather doesn't have you thinking ahead to the holidays, this certainly will. An unforgettable display of more than 1 million sparkling lights, holiday music, seasonal foods, and festive family fun. Even a train ride all set in a winter wonderland. For five weekends in November and December, Seven Springs Mountain Resort helps us welcome the winter season with holidays in the Highlands. Alex Moser of Seven Springs is here to tell us more about the celebration of winter along with one of the featured musicians performing each weekend at the resort, Scott Blazy of the Clarks. Good morning. Good morning. And you're not performing every weekend. No. But you will be there I'll one be of there the five. One we tried. We tried. <laughs> and he was like, oh no, you have three kids, so you're not going to be uh, yes. able to, yeah. Lots of commitments. December's a busy month for us. I bet it is. It's busy for a lot of people, yes. but this is certainly nice if you can take some time away to bring your family out and really get in the holiday spirit. We took Autumn Fest, which we've done successfully for 25 plus years, okay. and we said, well, let's, let's do an Autumn Fest version for the holidays. Yeah. So this is a full celebration of the holidays. We have one million lights throughout the resort that you can just drive your car right through and see it. We have a whole holiday village. Uh, we've got a lot going on there with some artisans and crafters yeah. and uh, carolers, and then we have, we've added uh, some of the holiday foods, and there's a 43-foot train you can do train rides with, which adults can go on as well. <laughs> um, believe me, they do. And uh, we've, we've just created a whole holiday environment, and it's, it's, it's worked out perfectly up at Seven Springs. And so this is the second year for the event. So has anything changed from last year? Obviously, it was hugely successful to bring it back another year. It was, it was very successful, and um, we're at, we added a couple things. One, we did add tubing, too, so we're going to be tubing all throughout, even if we're not open for skiing yet, which we hope we are. Yeah. Uh, we added tubing, but also what the, really the thing that we added to is we felt that we really need a, a concert component and and offer that to all the families that want to come and that's why we asked Scott if he could do a concert um, and each week we have a different show and so and you will be the last weekend right in, in December right. and this starts when right around it starts the Friday and Saturday right after Thanksgiving and okay. it's every Friday and Saturday uh, through the 23rd of December and that's Scott will pretty much close the uh, close the show okay and here is the concert schedule so who do we have coming up first on November 20th? We've got a Country Christmas with Chris Higby. So fun. Yeah, that's going to be great. And again, all of the, all of the musicians are playing their, their favorite songs, but also holiday songs as well. So each one is a holiday show. Uh, Pure Gold is the next week. Um, and then a rock and roll. The Chris, Jaggers. The Jaggers. And Billy Price is the following week. And then it all, uh, it all comes to uh, head at the end with, with, the Clarks. with the Clarks. And so you guys will also be performing some of your your favorites that Absolutely. people know you for. Sure, as some well Clarks as, classics. Yeah. And it's Rob, uh, Greg, and myself. We do an acoustic show, like an acoustic trio. It's a lot of fun. And so you normally don't just carry around a guitar. We actually asked you. Well, actually, <laughs> or, or do you walk right. down the street like this? Is this how you... I have a backpack case I just carry with me everywhere I go. <laughs> well, we asked you if you could bring your guitar because we would really like to hear one of the songs that you're going to perform. I'd love to. And you brought uh, Feliz Navidad. Yes, you. it's one of my favorite Christmas songs. I think maybe growing up in the 70s has something to do with it. But I just, <laughs> I've always loved this song, and we'll probably play this one and maybe a few others. Okay. Feliz Navidad. Feliz Navidad, Feliz Navidad, prospero año y felicidad. Feliz Navidad, Feliz Navidad, Feliz Navidad, prospero año y felicidad. I wanna wish you a Merry Christmas, I wanna wish you a Merry Christmas. I want to wish you a Merry Christmas from the bottom of my heart. I want to wish you a Merry Christmas. I want to wish you a Merry Christmas. I want to wish you a Merry Christmas from the bottom of my heart. Feliz Navidad. Feliz Navidad. Feliz Navidad. Prospero año y felicidad. I want to wish you a Merry Christmas. I want to wish you a Merry Christmas. I want to wish you a Merry Christmas from the bottom of my heart. You were special, I feel in. like I know I was <laughs> kind of kind of lip singing over here <laughs> quietly. <laughs> I didn't want to take anything away from your Thanks. beautiful performance. Right? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So I was it Friday you guys were making snow? 
We, uh, we had a nice little cold spell, if uh, you hadn't heard, and we had about 14 degree temperatures all Friday. And, yeah. and uh, yeah, we made about six feet of snow on Wagner and Phillips and some of the beginner slopes. And, and we're going to start curing the ground and getting ready. And so what are your hopes? I mean, we have a couple weeks. Still. Is it two weeks until until the concerts start? Or we, uh, Yeah, we no, it's, a, it's the Friday after uh, Thanksgiving. So, so yeah, yeah, we got about 10 days. 10 days. And uh, we historically, many times we have opened for skiing as well the Friday after Thanksgiving. So all fingers are crossed. And so what else can you tell us about Holiday in the Highlands? Uh, aside from the train, uh, train rides and the concerts and it's everything. A, it's a great opportunity for a quick winter getaway with a family. Um, mm -hmm. There's a great lodging package that includes some holiday gifts and, and a holiday buffet and just everything's included so you don't really have to pull out your wallet all, yeah. all throughout your trip and it, it's geared towards the families yeah. so mom and dad can you know sample some wine the kids can build some crafts some holiday crafts and everything is designed right around the family. Scott you mentioned that the lights were so beautiful did you go last year were you there last year yes, to see it? Yes yes my wife and I have a place uh, in the villages so we spent a lot of time at Seven Springs and we were there last year the lights are beautiful and we're going up the first weekend of December uh, for the weekend, so we're really looking forward to being a part of that as well. Make sure you let me get you some tickets. Yes, hook <laughs> me up, buddy. <laughs> so obviously, you've been there, you've seen this. Oh, this yeah. is such a great thing for families. Then and it you can really is. It's, to a, that. it's an amazing uh, opportunity for families to enjoy. And I, Seven Springs has really become a family resort, a Four, a four Seasons resort, yeah. and. Uh, it's really sort of evolved with me when I was young and wanted to party. It was a party place. Uh, right. And now, and now, now with kids, it's a really great place to take kids, and, and we love it there. Yeah. Well, thank you so much for joining us this morning, and Thanks it's for happy us. to learn more about the holidays. Welcome, uh, come welcome winter at Holidays in the Highlands at Seven Springs Mountain Resort for five weekends starting November 24th through December 23rd. You can get more details on the weekend lodging package that we just heard about that includes the concert, buffets, and a holiday gift back uh, online or by calling the resort, you can come for the day to experience the Holiday Village and light display and admission is free.